Hey everyone, Wags here from Eagle Dynamics, and in the next Hornet update, we're going to be adding a new function, yeah, target destination for the situational awareness display, or the SA display. So the big thing about this is it's going to allow us to see where our flight members are targeted with their uh, LNS, or launch and steering, for an air-to-air -air target, or the ground destination point. And we'll also be able to see the same thing for other flights uh, that are on our Link 16 network. So let's go ahead and bring up the uh, SA page. Let's go ahead and uh, decenter this. And what we're seeing here is uh, this is uh, another flight, and the segmented red line are their lock lines to their LNS targets. Let's go ahead and give our flight member an engagement order. Flight, engage bandits. And you can see that we're targeted this one. So this is the uh, red star indicating this is our LNS and we're double targeted with our wingman. So let's go ahead and switch to a different target, this one. So now uh, all four aircraft are targeted to different targets. Okay, now let's take a look at this on the air to ground side with uh, designating uh, ground points. Now with air to ground, it's going to operate in a very similar way. Let's take a look. So again, we'll go to uh, air to ground mode. Let's bring up the FLIR, see where we're going to target. Let's move the stick. And we'll bring up the situational awareness display. And zoom in. And we'll select waypoint one, designate this. So here's our designated target. And we can see here on the uh, SA, we have uh, another flight here, which is going to be attacking targets in the same island, and we have a single wingman. So let's give our flight member an order to engage ground targets. Flight. Okay, so our second flight is targeting, indicated by the segmented red lines, and our flight member see his designation by the solid red line. And of course we see our designated target here, indicated by the diamond. Now if we wanted to uh, remove these indications, of course, we can press the OSB here for a DX a DSG for target designation. So just like with air-to-air -air mode, this is a really handy function to avoid uh, redundant targeting. Anyway, folks, very much hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time. Thanks.